Okay, so here he is. Isn't he just so cute? He's okay. Whatever, he looks way better than the guys you've dated. Okay, I know you have a type, but that's far from the truth. He is though, he has such a cute smile, his body. Oh my gosh, his abs, let me look again. Okay, but did you just bring me here to talk about him the whole time? No, he's just on my mind. Sorry, girl. Well, have you even seen him in person yet? No. Has he even tried to see you yet? Well, a month ago. I just couldn't find the time to meet him. Why is it so hard for you to meet him? Well, for one, you know my parents. And two, he's like four years older than me. So, of course, he's not at our school. So, what school does he go to? He's homeschooled. Him and his parents just moved 30 miles from here. The only thing that's 30 miles from here, Chris, is Woods. Where exactly does he live? Why are you asking me all these questions? I just care about you. That's all. It's just that a lot of guys online have been doing a lot of catfishing. We've talked on the phone plenty of times. He seems real and genuine. I really want to meet him. Okay, well, my parents will be gone tomorrow night, so you can ask your parents if you can come stay the night. You can meet him at my house. My older brother will be there, so he'll take care of you if anything happens. Okay, girl, I'm gonna tell him right now, and I can't wait. Oh my God! Come in. Hey, mom, dad. Have you finished your homework? Have you done any of your chores? I know she hasn't because I just checked. I was getting Chris. You're so filled with excuses, and you can't seem to do simple things we asked you to do. What's wrong with you, young lady? Dad, I was going to get it done. Please, Mom, Dad, if I get it done today, can I please go? Please? Are her parents going to be there? No. Yes. Uh, which one is it? Are they going to be there or not? Yes, they will be there. We were just talking about it in the room, and I told her I can't go if her parents aren't home. Chris, you, you have a lot of things to do and you're not keeping up with your chores. You need to get your stuff done, okay? If I get it done before tomorrow, can I please go? Please? Hey, we can see about it, okay? But first, you need to get your chores done, do your homework, and clean up. Yes, sir, I'll get right on it. Okay, here we go. like being in the middle of the things you do, Chris. I'm sorry, but what else was I supposed to do? You know they're not gonna let me come over if your parents are home. Then maybe you shouldn't have come over. S really, Samara? You told me I can meet him at your house. And I already told him, so he's coming. Yeah, well, he already lied, so I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you, thank you. Bye. Bye. How do I look? Do I look okay? For the fifth time, you look great, girl. I know, I'm sorry. I'm just really nervous. It's just a guy. Calm down. I am calm, Samir. You know you're starting to come off as jealous? Jealous? Are you kidding me? I've done nothing but show concern for you. I'm not jealous. You're starting to act a little stuck up because of this guy. I'm not acting stuck up. You're just being very dramatic. All I've done... Oh my gosh, he's here. Okay, Chris, I'm gonna walk you out. No, that will make me look scary and I don't want to give off that impression. I need to walk you out there. What if something happens and he's not who he says he is? Relax, nothing's gonna happen. You never know. Okay, he's still calling me, so I'm leaving. I love you, girl. I love you too. Please be careful and call me if you need anything. Okay, mom. It's not funny. Chris, you need to start taking these things more seriously. See you later. What the? Help! Who are you? Somebody help! Please get off of me! Shut up! No one's going to hurt you! Please! I just want to go home! Somebody help! I said shut up! Where is Chris? Where are you guys? Um, I'm home. I, I don't know where Chris is. I'm so sorry, Miss Mary. I asked her not to leave and she left anyway. What do you mean she left? 
She was supposed to be at your house. Where are your parents? They were never here, Miss Mary. I'm so sorry. Oh my God, this is my fault. When they didn't answer, I should have just made her stay here. Why would you guys lie? Now my child could be dead or worse. I can't believe this. I'm calling the cops there and I'm on my way. What have I done? Chris was kidnapped and found unconscious. She eventually woke up, but was never the same. Her parents were furious and blamed her friend for everything. Here's what could have happened had Chris just been more cautious. Okay, so here he is. Isn't he so cute? He's okay. Whatever. He looks way better than the guys you've dated. Okay, I know you have a type, but that's far from the truth. He is though. He has such a cute smile. His body. Oh my gosh, his abs. Let me look again. Okay, girl, but are you sure that's even him? I hope so. I really like him. Have you seen him on video call or in person? I haven't actually. Well, where does he go to school? He's homeschooled. Him and his parents just moved 30 miles from here. The only thing that's 30 miles from here is Woods, Chris. Where exactly does he live? I don't know. When there's more cons than pros in an online relationship, Chris, those are red flags. Pay attention. Let me try and video call him. Call him. He says he can't video call. His camera isn't working. Hey, why can't I video call you? You know why? My camera doesn't work. There are more ways to call than one. It's 2022. Why are you always questioning me, huh? We can meet in person. Ugh, no, Chris. He sounds too persistent. He's definitely lying. Block him on everything. Already done. How scary. Let's go get some smoothies or something, girl. Okay, girl, let's go. The moral of the story is online dating can be very dangerous. Pay attention to the red flags. Be careful who you meet. Be sure to inform someone about your whereabouts when leaving with someone you don't know. No matter how much you want to stand in your friend's corner, wrong is wrong. Speak up if you feel something isn't right. 